very good morning to you. Thank you, Mrs. H. I'm uh, using a f different filming setup today, so you have to forgive me if it looks different, sounds different. Um, so hopefully we'll be okay. Are you are you well? That's the main thing. Even though I'm talking to a piece of glass. <laughs> I hope you're well. I'll probably mark the camera. Now. Um, yeah. So we're having a well. Something I wanted, I love citrus, we're having a citrus based shave, a um, bit of a yellowy themed, I don't even remember the towel. I'm going to use this stuff, I've had this for years and years, Derby shaving cream, we've got the Derby shaving soap, uh, moisturising shaving cream, lemon, so for me I love anything like that. So i put some in the base of this uh, fine accoutrements bowl. We're going to use, so I've had that cream a few years and I'm going to use this as a, well as far as I'm concerned, one of the best introductions to wet shaving, good quality, good price and British built. The Edwin Jagger DE89, uh, three piece, non-adjustable, this one's the clear smooth handle. Um, I was gifted this because I mentioned in one video I said I'd like to get the I'm sorry I didn't get the clear handle because I got the lined DE89L um, which I've got there. Uh, love the razor, it's the same shave but uh, just the handle and really nice. I like this. So we're going to go with what are we going today? What have we got under here? Sunny. Oh, we'll go with Sunny then. Number one. I'm going to pick. Excuse me, going to have the shot. Use the sunny blade. Supreme stainless. Second use. Nice to have a simple, relaxing, easy shave, hopefully. Slight overhang to be aware of. There you go. Now the brush is simply for the handle. That's the nearest to yellow brush I've got. And it's the Yaki 24mm Tuxedo Synthetic um, Sagrada Familia brush. Lovely little brush there. Um, and that's it. So we're going to wet the face. We need a shave. And then I am using a pre-shave today. Oil. Not that it's really needed but it's uh, it's nice to, to change it up. Make the shave a bit different isn't it? Alright. So uh, how is your week going? Hope it's going well. And your shaves, of course. And life in general. So we're going to have some shaving on. We'll go. We'll go with 10 drops. Think of it as adding, just adding a layer really of protection. That's lovely. Right. Rinse the hands. Oil and razors do not mix. There we go, especially smooth ones. Rinse that. So fresh. Hot water on the brush. This thing is recording, isn't it? Yeah. I've done that before now, talking to myself for 10 minutes. Here we go. You find sometimes, I don't know if you're the same, if you have some creams you've had a few years and you tend to go to them and you think, mm, is it going to work? Because some can sort of deteriorate in over the years. Uh, but this is working nicely so far. Yeah, so it's a lemon, just a lemon scent, what can you say? It's a, it's um what type of lemon? 
yeah so it's more of a it's like a it's a cross between the the sweet or the candy lemon and the um zestiness of the uh, zest of a lemon that type of is a bit of a combo for my for my nose here we go so i've just added a bit of water to that Easy as that. I tell you, Mrs. H has been very busy this uh, last weekend up, up to, um, well, last night really, uh, in the garden doing redesigning the uh, well part of the hair somewhere the back garden um, and at some point it will be in one of my videos on my other channel it may even feature in a shave yeah we're coming to that weather now it'd be nice some outdoor shaves on it so here we go have you had an outdoor shave yet in your garden or on well if you're on holiday maybe yeah on a balcony and on a beach uh, if you do, I hope you enjoy it. So Edwin Jagger, DE89, using the Sunny Supreme Stainless, second use, feels nice. And we're using the Derby Shaving Cream, Lemon Scented. And of course we've used the pre-shave oil uh, which is nice good idea if you have a um, if you have a shaving cream or soap which isn't that maybe not not as slick as you like and therefore you may not tend to use it that often so to save wasting it maybe add some you know add um, shaving oil or pre-shave oil or soap to you to um, shave it does help now this blade second use in this razor is a high-end mid aggression nice feels nice Well, it's going to feel quite slick this because I've you know put the oil so the next pass we should tell better with the cream itself there we go oh, I've well, got to say the sun was shining yesterday, it was a beautiful day. It's a day where you're obviously working but you're thinking of, oh I could be doing this today, oh I could be doing that. <laughs> Here we go, cross the growth. So no issues with the handle, um, no slippage, anything like that.
it's a similar I'd say aggression to this razor head similar to a Merca 34C because I think you find a lot of people have either gone for these or the 34C and they've stuck to it you know What's the growth? Lovely this, really relaxing. I hope it's as relaxing to watch as to as it is for me. That's the idea. Or interesting I should say. Now we'll tell the creams. Oh yeah, very nice slickness. Very good. Wow, I didn't think it was that. Oh, good old Derby. You know, some people would stick their noses up at these type of creams and. Uh, You know, if they haven't paid 30 or 40 pounds for a soap. It's uh, not worth, not worth using, but it's, uh, you know, as I say, I've had this for years and it worked really well for me. It's, even now I was thinking, it's, it's that old, should I uh, chance it? When you, you can tell when you put out the tube really if it's, not gone off, but um, if it's going to play up, and sometimes they do go off, it depends on the ingredients. But uh, no, no problems whatsoever. So against the growth, here we go. On this April, Wednesday morning. Two thousand and twenty three, in case you're watching this in many years to come. Hmm. Caught there. Did you feel that? Because I didn't. I did do something here, didn't I, last time? It's an awkward spot there for me. Oh dear, because it grows like a star always. So, uh, sometimes when you're trying to shave always to try and get every little, every little bit, it uh, can overdo it a bit. I'm hoping next week, I get a bit of time next week, off. Um, so I'm hoping I can uh, have the time to, um, to read the comments as the shave's gone up, you know. And uh, 
say hello, you know, reply to them. Lovely, like the old days. That is lovely. You can't argue with that, does the job. It's a very mild scent, light scent. Um, so it's not in your face, really slick, very, very slick. Wow, I didn't think it was that slick, to be off, to be fair. So it hasn't lost any of its quality that way. Uh, the scent, is, as I remember, has not lost any sort of strength. Uh, so it's kept well. Um, mind you, it is, in a, it is quite tight, that, so it's... And then the draw, dark, out the way, it's not in the sun or anything, so it's, um, it's done good. I'm just going to put the lid on this, because... I tend to forget sometimes, get hold of it and either tip it or... No. Uh, right, three, two, one, pick up time, baby. Yeah, you betcha. Yeah. Good. Waste not, want not. Won't be in work today. Why not? Sun shining. Book myself a day off. Yeah, that'd be good, wouldn't it, if you could just do that. Uh, the sun shining today, I'm not coming in. Oh, do you know what I'm having for lunch today? You may call it a grilled sandwich, we call it a toasty. Uh, you butter the bread, butter side down in the pan, in a toasty a ridge monkey. I'm trying it. Uh, cheese, onion, tomato, and some some of this hot sauce I've got, which is like a mustardy, piccalilli type thing. And uh, some of that on. It's beautiful, so I've got a couple of them for lunch today. Would you care to join me? Hmm? I'll put a few more on. Make us a cup of Yorkshire tea. <laughs> That's lovely, right. Cold water rinse. Gives you heart attack stuff there. Oh, it's lovely. That is my matching towel. Lemon. Oh, and flowers. <laughs> and matching thayers. Lemon. This has lasted for years, this stuff. Mind you, oh, that's lovely, that is. No wonder I use this so often. Mind you, you think it's... God, the slickness is good, you know. I swear I'd added a barn or something. And maybe we'll leave it there, then. <laughs> this is one of my favourite lemon colognes. Doodle. If it would be father worthy, let's say. And then we're going to go to this Bart's. I don't know if they do this now, you know, because I uh, went to their website. They do 
balms, but I don't think they do the slime one anymore. Lime one, they may do. Or they might be mixed up with something else, but the bottles are very different now. So we're going to use a bit of this uh, Bart's Lime Oil. Bam. And that'll do. Quite thin then. But lovely. Yeah, there's the limey type. Lime, limey, not lemony sort of. Yeah, it is lime. It's lovely. Because sometimes some of these scents, it says lemon and one says lime, and, and you can't really tell the difference. You can tell it's citrus and that's it. But with that soap, the shaving cream, lemon, very mild, uh, that is lime. Not, yeah, mildish. And that, that's a, that one there, that's lemon. And that's, Quite happy with that. Quite happy with that. So we've used the Edwin Jagger DE89 um, standard razor, a plain handle, smooth, beautiful thing, chrome plated. We've used the Sunny Supreme Stainless DE blade, second use, perfect. Feels high end mid aggression with that blade, but it's a standard aggression. Otherwise, with what my go to blade, which would be Wilkinson Sword or a Persona Red or something like that. Um, we've used the fine accoutrement bowl, Derby lemon shaving cream. We've used the Sagrada Familia 24mm uh, tuxedo synthetic brush by Yaki. Oh, we've used the pre shave oil, really nice. Welsh water to rinse, you Paul. Thayer's lemon witch hazel, Duru lemon cologne, and uh, the Bart's lime oil. Bam. The reason I like this particular one is the nearest, if not exact, as the Evin lemon I used to get in the posh bottle. And I was told that. Very, very helpful that was. Thank you. Whoever you were. So have a great week, rest of the week. Hope the sun is shining wherever you are. Uh, stay safe, stay happy, and um, yeah, look after yourselves. And I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave. Look forward to seeing you. Many thanks, and bye bye. Thank you.